bronze final match at the Echo Judo Hero Challenge between Miklos Ungvari and Musa Mogushkov. From Tumen. Mogushkov, 32 years, 8 years difference with uh, the challenger Musa Mogushkov. He was the number 3 of the World Championships 2011. And as we know, Miklos Ungvari was in the final of the Olympic Games against Lasha Shavdatouishvili. He's here in the stands and watches this match for bronze. The winner will take uh, awarded by a sponsor, Echo, who made it all possible to have this event here in Tumen. Shoe Company. Ungvari hey. trying to prevent Mogushkov to get this left grip. Try the combination. Referee Franz Ochko of Slovenia. Also his last match. Let's not forget. One of the main referees at the Olympic Games. And he refereed the match between Stevens and Bischoff. No score here. that doesn't impress uh, Unvari so uh, so much because he's an expert in Nevada. So far no real attacks of uh, Unvari. But neither did Mogushkov. easy by Ungvari. You've worked so long in the Olympic quadrennial to this shape at the Olympic Games. But it was clearly uh, not the right peak for Mogushkov. He lost on the... Ungvari also lost the last match at uh, the European events this year. Also a good motivation not to lose here, the last fight. <laughs> One minute to go for some more action. Unvari. He defeated uh, Mogushkov twice, but that was in a team event at the European Championships in Miskolc in, uh, in his own country. Actually, it was Mogushkov who defeated Ungvari the last time in 2010 at the IGF Grand Slam in Moscow, the semi final. It was uh, a Grand Slam that he won. Also, Mogushkov fought Miklos' brother, one of his brothers, of course. Attila, in that time as a junior.
It's hard for Mogushkov to reach the taller Ungvari, and he cannot get to his grip. And Ungvari tries these uh, combinations, but also not successful. That's why we go into the golden score now, for the next three minutes. Okay, the usual groundwork for Ungvari. Can he escape, Mogushkov? Looks like it, yes, Mate. Ungvari defeated uh, Sugoi Oriarte in the semi-final of the Olympic Games and Oriarte is in the final later on. I've not seen a real strong attack in this match. We're waiting for that. And there was not a good grip. The first fact of Mogushkov in this match. But also not convincing enough. Also, Mogushkov has to uh, gain a lot of power in his new category on the 73 kilograms because so far he doesn't have the physical uh, circumstances to uh, face the new opponents. He's smart enough, and usually it's an advance to start in a new category. Let's show it in your last match, Musa. Not many athletes of the Olympic Games have um, started. Some did in the Asian World Tour. And now there's a penalty for Ungvari. So he needs to take the inif initiative. The only athlete that you see continuously is uh, Iliadis. Also in the training camps, the OTCs. Again, no score. 18 seconds, otherwise we'll have Hamtai. And so far it has not been convincing, so I wonder what the decision would be. Cheer for the fighters, because we want to see the score, ideally. The winner, the right winner must be the winner. And it's a hard decision now for Franz Otsko. Three, two, one. Zero. 